Lucas Grove and Baggio Corner. Olivier Curse without final instructions. Three rounds of action. Muay Thai inside the one Super Series cage, live from Church, Jakarta, Indonesia. Church, Church On the top it. Ready? Ready? And Sturgos Mikios. Look for the hands and the leg kicks of Mikios. Look for that traditional Thai technique of Topic. Mikios could not be sucking into the metronome pace of Ogyen Topic. Topic checks the low kick early. Fake there from the Greek goes to the inside thigh. Thick legs on Ogyen Topic. This is a Muay Thai contest. They are allowed to clinch and throw as many knees as they like in the clinch so long as they stay busy. Quick hands already come into play for Sturgos Mikios. Both athletes coming out a little bit slower, which is typical in a Muay Thai contest. Now, Michael, do you think this pace favors Topic over Mikios? I think it does. This is what Topic is used to. But the reason why most Muay Thai contests start slowly, particularly in Thailand, is because they bet live on the contest ringside. We don't do that here, of course, at one championship. So I'd like to see a bit more explosion in the first round from these two men. They've only got three rounds. Well, that's right. Minutes. Usually Muay Thai have got five rounds, but under these exciting, dynamic one Super Series rules where it's all about action, it's three rounds. Checks a low kick, does Ognyan Topic. Mikyos still fainting and faking, the Greek in the black. Topic edges forward, jab two down the center corridor. Haven't seen Topic go for those head kicks yet. There he goes for it. High left roundhouse kick. Changes the stance momentarily. That's what he's doing. He looks to give a little bit of a different look. What shot Topic to fame years ago in line fight was knocking out a tie opponent with a head kick. It was spectacular. Launched him on the world stage. Now they clinch up for the first time. You can see those momentary switches of stance from Topic kind of freezes Mikios and he kind of stalls ever slightly. And that's where that head kick is coming off so fast. Mikios needs to get inside the kicking range of Topic. Bang to the body, bang to the jaw with their hands, then get out. Don't think this is necessarily the game that Mikios wanted to play thus far. Now the Greek pocket rocket comes in, fires the overhand right. Topic turns in, and there's a dump from Mikios. 30 seconds left in the first round. Topic gloves up high, fakes a front kick, goes down the center corridor with the right. An intriguing opening round here. Now Topic with the heavy artillery, they clinch again, and Topic dumps the Greek. Nice little follow up knee there on the exit. One dump per athlete so far in the opening round. Beautiful tape kick to the midsection from Topic. Then from Topic, dumps it again into the first round. We go to the towels. Now, don't forget, once again, our three judges cage side are scoring every round on a 10-point must system. The winner of the round gets 10 points. The loser of the round gets nine points. Don't forget, download the one championship, one super app. All world championships, all fights, all live. It is all free. Go to the app store now, download it, simply type in one championship. You can watch us in 136 countries. Indonesia, Philippines, Japan, Singapore, and beyond. Make sure you check your local TV guide. So three judges must have given one of these two combatants a 10, one of these two combatants a nine. Did they give the 10 points to Topic, or the 10 points for the round to Sturdigos Mikos? Second round of action, magnificent crowd inside the Jakarta Convention Center. For the largest martial arts organization on the planet. And here we go, one super series, Muay Thai. Second round. Beautiful jab to outside thigh kick to start from Mikyos. You can see a slight reach advantage from Topic. He's able to kind of just find that range, throwing out that jab. He's also utilizing that push kick quite well. Mikos has got to get on the inside of the Serbian. Right hand connects. Wasn't the overhand right that he loves, it was the quicking right hand. 
Now we're seeing some of the kickboxing from Mikyos. Beautiful jab too there from Topic. Every time they land, a very educated striking crowd here in Indonesia are ooing and are Clinch and knee from Topic and referee Olivier Cost separates them. I feel Mikios needs to step up the pace now, Mitch. Yeah, he's got to pick things up a bit. He's got to utilize a little... I like that combination he was throwing. He threw a three-punch combo, ended it with a leg kick. He's got to do more of that. He's also got to stay away from the clinch. You can just see how dominant Topic is in the clinch. Beautiful time. Dead center of the cage there from Ogden Topic. Muay Thai one-on-one. And Topic is setting the pace. He's set that metronome, the danger we spoke about Mikios falling into. That rhythm, and Mikios was right. He, Topic has a beautiful rhythm, and he's actually being hit, almost hypnotized by that rhythm. He's got to do something to break the rhythm, change the tempo. He's, he's competing and, and trading at Topic's level. Beautiful jab combination there from Mikios. Certainly, Ogyen Topic has had the upper hand the dump so far. Now, the dumping in Muay Thai, when you clinch with your opponent and wrench them to canvas, it's called a dump. It doesn't score for you. It looks very well in the judge's eyes, however, but really it depletes and deflates your opponent mentally because they need to pick themselves up off the canvas. It's a huge part of Muay Thai. And usually the more authoritative combatant in the cage or in the ring will be the one doing the dumping. At the moment, that's Ogyen Topic. Watch for him to spin, throws the knee up. Olivier breaks him up. Like what I'm seeing from Topic so far. Mikios needs to up the intensity, needs to get to his own game, not be sucked into this very Thai style game of Topic. You see Mikios standing There's still, like waiting for like Topic to initiate. Usually, when we see Mikios in action, he's the one initiating the action. Deer in headlights is frozen. Now he's pushing forward. See, when he goes first, he's successful. This is more like it than combinations Mikios is known for. And Topic ties him up. Final stages of the second round. Glimpses and bursts from Mikios. Uppercut elbow from Onion Topic. Once again, the referee will break them in the clinch if they are not keeping busy with the knees or the elbow. That's two rounds down. And I believe a 2018 contest to Ogden Topic so far. See, that's where Mikios is most successful, when he's going first, when he pushes the pace, throws a combination, punctuates it with a kick, but he can't fall into A, the clinch, and B, letting Topic go first. Look at that beautiful jab, overhand right. And then from the clinch, he was able to get the clinch, spin him around, and dump it in down, showing that dominance. Ogden Topic, a Muay Thai masterclass so far. You are seeing world-class Muay Thai from Topic, placing his kicks, placing his hands, executing those dumps to perfection. In the clinch, he's working the knees. He brought in the elbows towards the end of the second round. It's all for Step Josh Mikios of Greece to do in the third round now. He's got to turn the tide. He's got to swing the pendulum. But Topic so far too good it's time for Greek Dynamite to explode we've had two rounds so far it's a 10 point must system on my unofficial scorecard I would have gone 10-9 Topic first round 10-9 Topic second round which means Ognian Topic leads 2018 so Mikios either needs to drop Topic or obviously get the knockout. Now, if he drops his opponent, if he drops Topic here in the third, and Topic doesn't drop him, it'll be a 10-8 round to Sturgots Mikios. And another dump there from Topic. Beautifully done. You saw Mikios apply the knee guard, and Topic just said, well, I'll dump you to the canvas. I think that's maybe four dumps now for Topic in this contest. He picked up the left leg. He saw the off-balancing, spun him to the right. No support on that side. Beautifully done by Topic. And unfortunately... Sturjos Mikos is playing the wrong game here. He has fallen into the rhythm of Topic. What he said he didn't want to do, he is allowing Topic to strike first, not getting in and out or using his angles or his combinations that he's renowned for in his kickboxing. There's the overhand right finally from Mikos, and Topic felt it, and there's the left hook from Greek Dynamite. Could he finally explode? 
Inside lead from Topic, throws a knee. Glimpses again there, Mitch. Glimpses from Sturgios Mikios. I don't think it's enough, though. Beautifully done. As Mikios was coming in, as he was starting to rush forward, you could see Mikios sweep out that front leg and just off balance him just a little bit. Mikios has got to go forward. He's got to push forward. Oh, a beautiful threaded high knee there from Ogden Topic. Looks for a dump again and gets it. Lovely work there from Ogden Topic. Time. Olivia Cost is going to clear the knee late. It was, it was, so under these Muay Thai rules, you cannot throw the late knee once your opponent has the grounded knee, as Sturgeos Mikos did, and a warning there from Olivia Cost. I don't think he's trying to throw it in that manner, but I think he's trying to throw it, and as Mikios is trying to hit the ground, then he's trying to throw the knee, but Mikios just put his knee down a little bit too soon, and that's why the knee looked late. Some frustration creeping in on Spiridos Mikos. Heavy roundhouse kicks thrown by Topic. The Greek has got to go first and he's got to go now. Under a minute remaining. Topic throws the head kick, hoping for the headache maker. Switches starts to Southpaw. Throws the back leg. Now switches back to Orthodox. This is once again a master class from Ognian Topic. Beautiful knee, belly button through the back. There's one to the forearm. Looks for the dump and gets the dump again. That may be six dumps now for Ognian Topic. He is in control. 30 seconds left. High kick from Topic. Knee again to the midsection of the group. The bread basket. All that Mikos can do now is hope for a knockout. Is he going for it? Topic is smiling at it. Topic to the waist. The serve bringing it home with the kicks. There's the left hand out of South North Stark. What a dance from Coppins. What an elbow. What a dunk before the bell. Onion Coppins completely owning Sturgeos Mikos. That is that Thai style Muay Thai as he's throwing punches, catches the off balances, sweep out the support leg. Good effort by Mikios, but Coppins just looks stellar in that performance. Muay Thai 101. From Ognien Topic. Mikios left his charge far too late. Beautiful. This is where he was most successful when he was coming forward. But then Topic actually was able to figure out the range, understanding the distance, and getting that head out of the way as Mikios was rushing forward and then countering, finishing with the dump. He was punctuating each exchange. Good performance. Both individuals got to give it to Topic, though. So, folks, how did you score it? Every round is scored on a 10-point must system to 10 points go the winner of the round, nine points the loser of the round. I have it 30-27, all three rounds for Ognien Topic. Wherever you're watching around the world on the One Championship app on Facebook and on Twitter, how do you score it? Ognien Topic or Sturgeos Mikios? Let's go to Dominic Lau and find out our winner. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of battle, we turn now to the judges' scorecards. All three judges have scored this contest in favor of your winner by unanimous decision from the right corner. victorious by unanimous decision and the champion medal from this match goes all the way back to the USA around the neck of Ognin Topic.